Hi everyone, Matt with SplitDragon.com here. Uh, thanks for your time uh, jumping into this video. So uh, hopefully you've watched the first five videos that I put together um, about uh, Lozada Seller Center walkthrough and how to sell on Lozada. Uh, this is uh, going to be uh, the second article where I talk about campaigns and promotions. So uh, campaigns and promotions uh, are critical in Southeast Asia for, 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 for online sellers. So you look at 11-11, 12-12, 9-9, the mid-year campaign, Ramadan, campaign, Chinese New Year campaign, these get massive uh, investment from Lazada for driving traffic. Uh, and, and, and sellers are, are, and brands are competing on price very seriously at these times. So you can see as much as a, a month's worth of sales over a period of two days if you optimize your campaign as well. So um, you, you definitely want to try to make sure that you're appearing in all campaigns. Um, after you submitted yourself to a campaign, Lazada can approve or reject. Uh, your your entry, um, but at the end of the day, you should you should be trying to make use of uh, these additional free marketing opportunities that are available to you. So last time uh, I talked about uh, platform campaigns, which are just kind of gen general price decrease campaigns. Uh, in, in this instance, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to talk about voucher campaigns, okay? So voucher campaigns are very similar. Um, so basically, it's just a campaign where you're, you're going to cut your price, um, but you're going to use a voucher. That's going to be the mechanism for doing it instead of just going in and decreasing sales price or retail price. So, um, you know, here we can see right now that there's a there's a campaign for non-electrics category. Uh, it's called the Great Singapore Sale. Uh, registration closes in four days right now. We've had 1,700 sellers that have signed up. 2,700 uh, vouchers have been generated. And the campaign is live for the standard seven days, 15th to the 21st. Um, and uh, the vouchers need to start at the 27th of May, and they can end um, by like the 14th of June, right? So that's when we need to make them, uh, that's when we need to create our vouchers, okay? So you can go and you can click June, uh, click, click, click join. And uh, uh, now we see more details about the terms. So the absolute discount needs to be more than $2 than your current um, sales price or whatever is visible on Lazada. Uh, the voucher discount requirement. Um, so the voucher needs to be greater than 5%. The absolute amount needs to be more than $2. Um, and then the, the minimum order spend. Uh, so the minimum order spend is usually what you set to tell the seller that you know they must purchase this amount in order to get the discount. Uh, Lazada doesn't want any, anything more than $400, so it needs to be a little bit lower than that. Um, and then you, you, you also, when you create vouchers, you specify budgets and qu maximum quantities. So the minimum budget that's, that's allowable is $50, and the, the, the minimum quantity is $100. So um, quite a bit here. Uh, quite quite a bit of terms uh, that are necessary, but I think they all they all kind of make sense. So let's just go ahead and click uh, join now. Um, so if we go to join now, then what we look at and we can see um, the different types of vouchers that are available to us. So let's go ahead and do a percentage value voucher. Uh, they said that it needed to be five percent, so let's put it at ten percent off. Okay, and it can apply to uh, you know whatever whatever approved campaign products. Okay, uh, the voucher name can be my uh, Singapore campaign uh, great Singapore sale regular voucher something like that that's pretty simple minimum spend needs to be less than 400 if you remember so let's go ahead and make it 300 usd total issue number we can put it at 50 um maximum discounted value uh this is an optional field so we don't even need to include this you can include it if you want um, but it'll make sure that you protect how much money you give away um also, we can set the usage limit for an individual customer. If you do mess up on your vouchers, you can have a customer that will go and buy 20 units um, on multiple orders. They'll contact their family. So you really need to be careful with your vouchers. I've, I've, seen, some, I've seen some war stories. Um, but so usage limit per customer, I think maybe you put three. So we want to have someone, um, if they really like our, our budget, they can come back and buy multiples. Um, so we, we set it as three. And then basically after that, you submit your campaign. You submit your promotion. Oh, wait, I got an error. Sorry, the maximum value of redeemable per customer is two. Okay, so the maximum is two, so we just go ahead and update this to two. Oh, the minimum count for the voucher issued is 300. Okay, so 
please check your input again. So this looks like there's going to be a Lazada system error uh, within the environment uh, because we are above, um, oh wait, no. let's go to 250, 250, okay, now we're done. All right, so that was the error. So they, I need to issue more than 200 and I was issuing 50. Um, so now that I input 250, uh, things are clear. And now I just need to go and, and confirm what it is that I am uh, signing up for. Please double check and make sure the below information is correct. 10% off um, it's for all submitted campaign products. These are the dates. It's a collectible voucher and it's just going to be through a regular channel. So basically now all I do is I confirm and submit and then I get into the approval process where Lazada will go and they'll review my products and they'll res review the vouchers uh, and basically approve or reject uh, my, my products for appearing within the campaign. Um, so that's, that's basically it um, for um, uh, campaign management voucher campaigns. Um, if uh, so, really, it's pretty much identical to a platform campaign. The only difference is that in a platform campaign, you're decreasing your price or your sales price by amount that Lazada specifies. And then within voucher campaign, what you're doing is you're uh, you're introducing a voucher that will de decrease your price, and then sellers or I mean buyers can go and uh, click that voucher, and then that's their mechanism for getting a decrease in price. So it's it's really the same thing on your bottom line. It's just two different different mechanisms for a Lazada uh, to market and drive traffic. So that's uh, that's all for voucher campaigns. If you appreciated this video, um, please go and sign up at blog.splitdragon.com for more uh, tips, tools, and tactics to help you improve your business. Or if uh, you're, you're already an active seller, I encourage you to check out splitdragon.com um, and, and sign up for a free seven-day trial. Uh, and, and test out our software and see how it's empowering, uh, you know, 2,000 plus sellers across Southeast Asia, uh, improve their sales and profits. So um, thanks for your time. Uh, I hope you have a great day and, and, and we'll talk again soon. Thanks.